Good use of this. When you're wounded, you have to strike back. Draw blood. Hey! Can I get one damn minute to mourn my friend? Regala is going to slaughter my tribe to overthrow Hikaru. The Zeniths have Beta and Gaia. We can't sit around wallowing in our losses. Kotalo's right. We must fight. Oh, all right. So what are we going to do, huh? Take on all of Regala's rebels? Not to mention the Zeniths. What can we even do? Throw ourselves at their base? Something like that. So...
After we lost contact with you, we regrouped and went to Gemini. What happened? The recording we found on Varl's focus cut off when that Zenith Eric... The Zeniths were tracking Hephaestus. When Gaia trapped it in Gemini, they... They knew where we were. After... Varl tried to stop them. They took Beta and Gaia. I only survived because one of the Zeniths turned against the others to save me. One of them? Well... At least we didn't lose you too. So what do we do now? We're going to defeat the Zeniths. And get Beta and Gaia back. But first... We're going to stop Regala. How? Back in Gemini, Beta gave me... A gift. There's something I need to do first to make it work, but it could put an end to the bloodshed. Word is, Regala's readying her army for an all-out assault on the Grove. I... need to be there. I know. Go. Stand with Akaro. And keep an eye on the sky. Strike true as the ten. The rest of you? Whatever preparations you need to make, upgrades, resupplies, get on it. It won't be long before we take the fight to the Zenith. We'll be ready, Aloy. And when you're ready, meet me outside the east exit. I'd like to have a word in private. Even when things are darkest, you're the flame that lights the way forward. Just tell me one thing. Am I gonna get to smash up a bunch of Zenith bastards? We all are. Good. Before I do anything else, I should check on Zoe. It sounded important. It's all going to be... You look busy. My studies are a good distraction. Especially after Cult and Gemini. Varl, Beta, Gaia... Gone. And that's just the beginning. The Zeniths want to rob us of our future, too. We won't let that happen. Oh, and uh, if you have a moment, there's something I could use your help with. You mentioned there was something you needed help with? Yes. Uh, so, as I was sifting through data from the greenhouse, I found references to an old world system back in the Great Delta. It's called Leviathan. My people discovered it decades ago. A sprawling network of river gates and a labyrinth of underground tunnels. The legacy revealed that the old ones used it to control flooding. But we've never gotten it to work. The whole thing is shut down. But the data from the greenhouse mentions the research facility where Leviathan was created. It's in San Francisco. Another Pharaoh facility? No. Leviathan was a project by Eileen Sasaki, another ancestor. So the legacy tells us, anyway. If we can acquire that data, we might be able to fix the system back in the Great Delta. Every year, my sister gets terrified when the long rains begin. With Leviathan, maybe she won't have to be. Okay. So, where in San Francisco is this facility? That's the thing. The data doesn't say where, exactly. But one of our diviners has been exploring the ruins. He might know. Would you come with me? I have a feeling that wherever this facility is... Well, you're much better at fighting machines than I am. Of course. I'll let you know when I'm in landfall. Thank you, Aloy. I should get going. Be ready to go on my signal, okay? I won't let you down. I know. And, like I said, I'll let you know when I'm in landfall. We'll find the data you're after. I appreciate it.
Over here, Aloy. We would come out here to tend to the garden. Sometimes I needed fresh air. Other times we would simply sit and watch the sunrise. So when we returned from Gemini, it seemed fitting that he be laid to rest here. Now he can always look out at plain song and... Further east, to the Nora sacred lands. He would have liked that. He often spoke of his sister, Bala. He said she used to gather her favorite golden blooms and tie them to her spear. Their mother called it useless, but... Bala was stubborn. Yeah, she seemed like that. It wasn't easy. But I tracked down the flower. Gathered its seeds. As verdant limbs wither, roots rot in snow, still the sea rises as certain stone. From death follows new life. So it is with the land. And so it is with us. I'm with child, Eloy. I was going to tell him when he got back from Gemini. Instead, one day, I'll bring our child here. We'll sit among the blooms. and watch the sunrise. I never got to tell him. To thank him. For saving my life, sure, but also... for not giving up on me. He always knew. Goodbye, Farl. I promise to look after them. I'll try to visit again when I can. But for now, I need to go to the fabrication terminal to install the new light on my spear. Now I'm gonna use it on a sunwing and get ready for an entrance where Gala will never forget. Override installed. Now to find a sunwing. I think there are some roosting at the top of the mountain.
focus. It's Forles. I used to think no Nora would ever accept one. But Forl did. Even when he was overwhelmed, he refused to let me push him away. I failed Forl at Gemini. I should have pushed harder. I should have done more. I'd give anything to have him back. All this time, I've been so focused on what Elizabeth was like, what she would do. I was wrong to hold Beta to that standard. I probably shouldn't even be doing it to myself. I'll try to do better. So Silent's plan was to trick Regala into sacrificing her tribe in a hopeless battle against the Zenus. It's so... heartless. Hikaru, Dekka, Catalo, countless others. I won't let their lives be thrown away. Can we talk for a moment? I thought you were gonna go fight some Tanakhs. I wanted to check in with you first. Yeah, don't worry about me. I'm just, you know, picking up the pieces like everyone else. I'll be there when you need me. I never doubted that. Oh, good. I'm glad you're back. So am I. Do you think... So we'll be okay. I don't think anyone's ever okay after losing the one they love. I can't tell you she's handling it better than I ever did. That keeps the rest of us level-headed. Have you spoken with Alva yet? Yeah, when she's not reading the archives like a giddy kid drinking her first ale. She took to that new focus quick, that's for sure. I gotta say, I'm a little jealous. But I can see why you two hit it off. Anybody take you up on that ale you brought yet? Zo can't stand the smell of it. I tried Alva, but I don't think she knows what taking a break means. What about Catalo? Ah, now there's a man that can hold his liquor. Pretty sure we downed half a keg. We had a good chat, I think. You look tired. Ha! You never want to hold back, are you? I've just been making sure that I got everything down for this mission of yours. We want to be the usual screw-up out there. He'll do fine, Errant. You should know. Silence is involved with the Sons of Prometheus. He's the one who gave them the override tech to begin with. Why doesn't that surprise me? That's probably all part of some master plan, huh? At least we know we're good at wrecking those. Damn straight. I need to get going. Uh, you better get there before Catalo tries to take on Regala's entire army by himself. Yeah, do me a favor. Don't go disappearing on us again. I'll do my best. Think you can manage things here while I go help Akaro? Stopping Regala's war. 
It'll help us take the fight to the Zeniths? Yes. Then I'll make sure the rest of us are ready upon your return. Okay. Oh. I also wanted to give you this. For helping with the land gods. Plain Song is in your debt. Thank you, Zhao. You deserve much more for all you've done. May the land always bloom in your steps. And... yours? <laughs> How to go with the chorus after we fix the land gods. They were shocked when I told them that our lands would soon be on the mend. I thought Fane's eyes would pop out of his head. But of course they had no choice but to take it as good news, even if it meant all their preaching about meekly accepting our doom was exposed as rot. To be honest, I found the conversation to be highly enjoyable. I'm glad. You deserve it. They're lucky that you never gave up on saving them. I need to get going. Whatever you plan on doing against Regala, you better return to us in one piece. I'll try. Okay, I need to find a sunwing to override. Better head up the mountain. Good. There are sun wings up here. We'll have to approach them quietly. See the whole village from up here. Maybe I should check in on it after I've dealt with Regala. Tilda, I'm in the air. Then you'll want to pick up an energy cell on one of the ancient Horus Titans. But first you must send out a pulse to activate them. I've sent you the necessary software. To deploy it, you'll have to override one of the communication machines referred to as Tolnex. There's one in the middle of the desert that should do nicely. On it. There's a tall neck. Need to get on top of its head. 
know how to land this thing. Okay, Tilda, I've overridden the tonic. Good. And the energy cells are now primed. Simply pick one up on a Horus. The nearest one should be northwest of your position. Dropping it on Regala's machine should produce quite a spectacle. Thanks for the assist. I told you, I want to help. That's the Desert Clan's capital. I can really see the scale of it. The Horus should be northwest of here. Where's the energy cell? I know it's hanging back.
got the soul. Now on to the grove. Pulse from Atomic should have reactivated all the energy cells in the region. I should be able to pick up more from the Horus I fled to. Pretty useful. Even after I deal with the Bella. inside. Hikara will soon be dead. It's all over, Chaplin. I gotta drop it now. Here it goes. of the ten. The tide has turned! Push through! <laughs> End of the line, Hakari. Now on your knees, and I'll give you the death you didn't have the spine to give me. They're down! The machines! All of them! They're down! What? How's that possible? Regala! Enough bloodshed! Let's settle this. You and me. Easy to say when you're on top of a machine. Well, that was just to get your attention. I don't need any help to take you down. Fine. I accept your challenge. And once I'm done with you, I'll get to finish the slaughter. We'll see about that. The duel is set. Let none interfere. Hey, Spot.
show strength! Giving up. I will paint this hallowed soil with your uh. blood. Oh! 
it ends. Yeah, it is. going. Here I am again, on my knees before bootlets and cowards. Go ahead, run me through. Shut your mouth, traitor. It was you who flew in on the wings of the Ten. 
You who challenged her by our rights, you must decide her fate. I spared her once. It only made things worse. She was the best of my marshals. What a waste. She's dangerous, all right. But maybe that's exactly what I need. Cowards! What more do you have to conspire about? Whether you live or die, You led a rebellion that tore a tribe apart. All for bloodlust and revenge. Maybe the only thing you deserve is to die right here. Or maybe... That fury can be directed at the real enemy. You want to ally with her? How can you even trust her? Despite all that she's done, she's never been one to break her word. Will she give it? I won't beg for my life. Decide. I'm not here to forgive you for your crimes. But there's another battle ahead. Against an enemy more powerful than anything you can imagine. And I need people, a squad, that's willing to do whatever it takes. I don't want your mercy. It's not mercy. The battle I'm talking about will be charging into a nightmare. A better death than this? Yes. My blood is yours. Your enemies are mine. Meet us at our stronghold, in the mountains near Plainsong. You mean to send her alone? Without even an armed guard? She does not need it. I will be there. You have my word. I'll hold you to it. Chief, there's something you both need to see in the throne room. <laughs> he surrendered to our guards outside the grove. Claims he has an urgent message for the outlander who defeated Ragala. So, state it. It's for her alone. From an interested party. I'm gonna need some privacy. Clear the room. Put him with the rest of Regala soldiers. I'll see you back at base. You saved the tribe. Let me help you with your mission. No. With Regala gone, you have a chance to build the future you dreamed of. So get to your task. Then at least allow me to give you this. Armor for the battle ahead. May it keep you safe. Do you have 
any idea what you've just done? Oh, it's a pleasure to see you too, Silence. Congratulations on your victory. You saved the Tanakh for a few weeks. Unfortunately, you doomed the entire planet as well. Wrong. I don't need a Tanakh army to defeat the Xenos. Oh, Eloy. Have you learned nothing about the enemy we're up against? More than you, hiding whatever hole you found. My idea is just better than anything you ever came up with. Go on. No, not here. We're doing this my way. Face to face, and with the weapon you've developed. And why would I agree to that? Because I'm your only way of beating the Zeniths, and getting the copy of Apollo that's on their ship. So meet me at my base. Mountains west of Plainsong. Time to submit to the inevitable silence and follow the person who actually knows what she's doing. Don't be late. Tilda, you there? I did it. Silence is on board. So head to my base. Impressive. I'll be there as soon as I can. Now that I can fly, I might want to see what else I can do before I head back. <laughs> 